Good morning, everyone. Happy Monday. everyone happy monday We've got some school going on jacks has a big science lab day it's a lot it's so much i didn't give him math and he's getting a day off from science tomorrow he actually has assignment later in the week it sounds really fun but he's feeling a little overwhelmed while he's in the thick of it i am tired like you would think that because we set the clocks back I would have fallen asleep easier because going to bed at 3 a.m. was actually 4 a.m. But no, I could not fall asleep. I was just tossing and turning. Finally around 5 a.m., which was the old six. I don't remember waking up anymore, so I guess I slept until about 7.30 when Jax was messaging me about his science. So here we are. It is probably like, I don't know, 9.30? It's almost 10. We kind of wasted time. I was folding clothes. I showered and I washed one more time. More on that. But we have groceries coming, so I'm trying to wait. They're coming in the 10 to 11 time slot, even though I like the 9 to 10. We always have bad luck. That's when it's always canceled or delayed hours. So I just feel like it's jinxed. <laughs> So I went with the 10 to 11. We're just having coffee and juice. Blue. No worries. That's just a reflection. Let's go back to the other blue. We don't need to put that much time into it. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, groceries are coming, so we haven't eaten yet. I've got to put those away. I was just cleaning out the fridge from the old stuff. It's been a while since we got groceries because I got later and later by a day and then it was coming in the middle of the weekend when everything was out of stock so i just we just rode it out and now we're back on track getting it on monday this is a better day because the groceries the groceries will come in the morning and then the trash gets put out tonight so all the old stuff can go out so that's good timing we'll stick with this hopefully I think everything except all our bread is coming. Nut, our garlic nuts for pasta night and our sliced bread for soup and sandwich night. Both not coming and those were our meals that I knew for sure. Oh, I won't keep it. I mean, can I? We can't because our bread's not coming unless we get bread tonight. So we'll have to see how the day goes. So today we're gonna do school, put the groceries away, eat. I have a list of 19 work projects, most fairly fast. I don't know until I do it, but it's I'll do by COB Wednesday, close of business, so 5 p.m.-ish. <sighs> I don't have any of it. I have none of it. Not that I would start just this moment, but I could, could potentially start like around 11 or 12. Okay, do the sticker. You know what, if you're happy, we'll just leave it and we can maybe come back to it or maybe not. So just move on. That's a lot of coloring, but it, it is practice for your hand to make your hand stronger. Do you know your hand have muscles, just like your arms? And your hand muscles have to exercise too to be used to writing and coloring. Coloring is a great way to get your hand muscles strong. Life tips. All right, so yeah. I don't know when that work's gonna come in. At least I have all day today, all day tomorrow. I did tell him I have an eye doctor's appointment. As I said, I made an eye doctor's appointment because I think this is not working anymore. And like my vision is totally fine up close, but 
it's not as fine as it was. Like I think it was better than fine being nearsighted. So now my glasses for seeing far away are screwing with my eyes up close and I have to take them off to see clearly. So we'll see what they do. I don't know if I'm gonna end up with some craziness bifocals or progressives or whatever they had. I had bifocals for a while, like in early college actually, like the line ones, because they were still trying to figure out my eyes and eventually a different doctor figured out I have an astigmatism and setting that has just like made the world a difference. But I don't even know what I was saying. <laughs> oh yeah, that's good. I was. So saying that I have the eye doctor's appointment because I don't have as much time to work today. But we need to get out. It's gonna be 65, I think, 64. So that's pretty amazing for November here. So we definitely need to go out and take a walk. Wait, that's gotta be a priority. It's not cold. It's cold right now. You saw daddy, he was in, oh, your jeans aren't buttoned. He's in jeans and a t-shirt and he put a flannel on over top of that. So you're perfect with jeans and a t-shirt and you just grab a long sleeve for the chilly woods. In the sun with no wind, I think we'll be fine though. But yeah, so we need to do that. Tonight, after dinner, I need to tackle more of these. I did stay up and I got 10 of these done. I have 26 left but I realized I can't hide under a hat at the eye doctor. I already am gonna have to try to do stuff with glasses and a mask on. Like, I guess I have to take things off to try on glasses, um, technically, but I won't make you, you know what a two is. Just do the tracing. It's just to exercise your hand. Yeah, like... <laughs> Yeah, we're gonna have to, uh, we, me. <laughs> I'm gonna have to be trying on glasses to find new frames because I'm gonna complete new pair of glasses and then I will take these to Costco to get new lenses. I don't know yet, probably. So yeah, I need to get my hair presentable, but I don't want to put dye in it until I have almost all or all, preferably all the braids done. I am gonna have yeah, to already redo some thing. of these. But if I can braid, I'll oh, see it in a minute. Please don't break your pencil. Yeah. If I can braid after dinner and then before bed as well, yeah. that would be ideal. We'll have to see how it goes. But I still don't know if I feel brave enough to use the hair dye I tested. Where is it? Where are you? Here it is. I have a test one, so this is after one wash, but I didn't really scrub it, and it's, it is sticking still to my bleached yeah. hair. I just don't know if I'm gonna end up having it forever. This is solid dye, and I would definitely dilute it and do it really light. So I think I'm just gonna have to go for it, and I just do my mixed whatever hair as it's fading out. I don't know, I don't know what to do, but I need to go, the coffee's done. That's a beautiful too. We are gonna do school until our groceries come, then we'll put them away and eat. So, sorry, I've been talking so long.
at Tina's house. It's a little bit past. Ooh, I need to get him to sleep. But he's in his jammies at least and he's had medicine. So yeah, we're we're almost there. I came out to braid after dinner and it was a, just a non-stop stream of people needing me. So I didn't get as much done, so I did go over a little bit. This is what I have left. I think it's maybe 15 or so. So yeah, I need to get more done and I would love to redo a few up here around the edges. I did one on the top of my head that was like really coming loose, but I also want to do Animal Crossing tonight. So I need to see just what all I can do. If I can get in here by one, I can braid for an hour to an hour and a half. So that's the goal. I'm not going to set up too much school tomorrow because I have to get out to my eye doctor's appointment. So we'll have, we'll have some school, but not a ton of school. Excuse me while I just get some things ready for bed. But I talked to you so much earlier that I've... Jeez, don't look at that. He got mad at me when I suggested we put it away. He's like, but then I won't find anything. So we're just gonna let this go for now and it is what it is. Don't look at it, Stephanie. Yeah, I don't wanna talk too much. But so far today I've gotten three of my 19 items off my work list. So I got all of those done. I did one label before quiet time. So quiet time is a little bit late. And then after quiet time, I did the other two while my husband ordered dinner. I asked for Mexican because eh, nobody really had a preference. And then, yeah, came up here. So that was the rest of the day. I've hopped on Animal Crossing at quiet time and then a little bit after, like during, while I was working, just so people could come to my town and get a recipe. But. Yeah, <laughs> this is my life tonight. The reason why I'm doing this is, as I said, I realize people are just gonna be all up in here and I need to see my face with glasses, lots of different glasses. It's already gonna be weird with a mask. I'm gonna plan on just narrowing it down to a few with the mask on and then hopefully I can find a mirror in the corner away from people and like pull off the mask for a moment. I don't know. And I'm hoping I don't have anxiety right now. I'm feeling okay. It's not like the dentists swear they were going to be in my mouth. The dentist is a tricky thing though because I have a lot of anxiety about not going to the dentist, which is weird. Most people have anxiety about going, but for me it's for not going. And what if my teeth are falling apart? I need to get in there. I need, like, I asked them to replace a filling that was old because if it's starting to have a dent, I'm like, please, you've got to do this. Otherwise I'll be so paranoid. So yeah, I don't have that same feeling, so. But if I feel anxious in the morning, I think I'm gonna write everything that I wanna talk about on paper so that if I'm having an anxiety attack, I can still hand that off to my doctor. But yeah, I guess I'm just gonna say goodnight and get him to sleep. I need to get all this stuff onto my head just temporarily. And then we'll edit this and yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. If you get bored and want to see what has gone on in previous years, 
and you may not know, I always put links to the previous years and videos for this day. And each of those videos will have the previous years as well. This video will have three previous years because I've been doing this a long time and so on. So you could follow it all the way back. And yeah, but I'll see you tomorrow. Stay safe, be kind, and don't forget, the puppies are downstairs, so it's gonna be meow your hands. Quick, quick, cat bus, cat bus, everybody love it. Don't forget. Cat your hands. Cat your hands and wash your hands. <laughs>